now be speaking to uh, Ebenezer Ejekum Boating, who is a colleague here at Media General in the uh, newsroom. He's actually out there uh, taking a look at what exactly is going on concerning the district uh, elections now. So I'd like to, uh, Ebenezer, are you on the line? Yes, Crystal. How are you doing? I'm doing good. And how are you? I'm very well, thank you. All uh, right. Where are you currently? I am at the Kanda electoral area, and currently I am at the Information Service Voting Center. Okay, okay. And what, what exactly is happening there now? Um, the process has come here. We have people trickling in one by one. It's not busy, and oh. I'm not expecting it to be busy for the first part of the period allocated for the voting, because this particular process have seen low turnout, as history will say. And so I'm not expecting a huge turnout. But um, let me say the Kanda electoral area has um, three uh, voting centers. Okay. And the one I'm now, the information service uh, station, has three polling stations. Okay. And they are expecting 1,196 uh, people to vote here but so far we've had only 25 people voting at the three uh, stations here wow. at the information service uh, center so out of the 1196 so far we have only 25 voting but the process has come no incident here we have security personnel here but they are having a holiday. <laughs> a holiday. What exactly do you think may be the reason uh, that people haven't come out in their numbers? Because you said only 25 out of 1,000 plus uh, have come to vote. What, what do you think may be the reason for the low uh, turnout? You, you, you look at the voting history of the uh, sub-national elections, you mm. will see that turnout hardly hit 50%. It hardly hit 50%. I think the highest we've had was about uh, 41%. Uh, so I'm not surprised turnout this morning is low. But I'm sure after midday, we'll see uh, a bit more of, an, of action coming in, people coming in to vote. You know our last-minute attitude to things. Mm -hmm. So people will wait and come in and vote so that they can wait for the counting. And where I am now will be the coalition center, for all the areas, so they will bring the other boxes, ballot boxes from the other centers to this area for, for counting, so, and which is also very close to us, so we'll be able to monitor this very well. But we are just hoping that the process will, will quicken up, okay. people will come in and, and cast their vote. Uh, okay, so would you say that uh, these uh, stations are adequately resourced for the elections? Um, can you come again? Would you say that uh, the station where you are, do you, would you say that they are adequately resourced for the election yes. so that uh, yes. the process actually yes. runs smoothly? Yes, it, they, they started on time. I talked to some of the presiding officers here. They mm -hmm. have presiding officers and returning officers. So I spoke to uh, the presiding officers for the three uh, stations and logistics were in on time. The polls opened on time, and so far there's been no complaints about more function of the biometric machine. Okay. So everything everything is in order. Okay. Then then, then that's 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 quite hopeful. You would be there um, all through the day, right? Or you, or would you? I will uh, be at the three three centers, so I will be moving around. Okay. So I will be very 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 busy moving around. So from here, I'm going to the Kanda cluster of schools okay. where there are. Two stations, two stations there. there. So then from the cluster of schools, I will go to another station called GNTC. Okay. Then from there, I will come back here. So I will be doing that rotation. Okay. But have, have you been to these other places already so you can update us as to uh, the state uh, of the, the weather there now? Yes. For the Tanda cluster of schools, I passed through it to see what was going. Everything was calm. Okay. Everything had started. Then for GNTC, also the same. It, 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 it's the same at all Across the three board. areas. 
So I'm going back now to the cluster of schools to get some statistics so that when I'm on air again, I will be able to give more details of what is actually happening there. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you so much, uh, Ebenezer Ejikumboateng. Hopefully, we'll get a lot more uh, updates as we go along. And we're, we're, we're going across uh, board. We're, we're trying to get you more updates, not just only in Kanda, but across the country as well. And so look out for those. Uh, and you are also encouraged to go out and vote. So we'll bring you more updates as to uh, what's happening at the various um, stations. So stay tuned.